In Raider practicing, in the heart of my hand, it's different. When we visit other teams and they tell us what they do, they're like, we run around the track or we run the forest or we have special obstacles set up. Space. Space is limited in the city. A traditional Raider course, you have woods to go train in. You can find two trees out there to do a one rope bridge. Um, you can go cross country running. You can, you know, build obstacles off site like a lot of these teams do that go to the nationals. We don't have that. So I had to think outside the box. We do the one rope bridge in our cafeteria. We, you know, we can't build rope bridges outside, so we have to make do with the cafeteria, which has worked. We've done very well at Raider competitions. It's a different environment going down to Fort Knox and just competing there. They want to do great. They want to do well. They don't want to go to a national competition and get embarrassed. The leadership that I see that they want to take to be able to get this team in shape is just far none. We train so hard at our school and what we can do. Although our training may differ from other schools, it's more or less the same and we make do with what we have and we just practice and practice and practice and eventually we'll get there. We kind of just do what we can, where we can and how we can. If you're not motivated to win, you won't win, but if you want it and you want it more than every other person in the Corps of Cadets throughout the whole United States, you will win. We all want it and we all want it together.